September 1st through the 7th is National Crime Prevention Week. This week works to remind residents that they are all responsible for ensuring our communities are safe and crime-free. We spoke to Public Information Officer Tony Kahn about ways you can help keep crime rates low. Our police department is, our mission statement is this, we are a community-oriented policing department, which means we want to be a community partner. And in order to do that, we, we need the community's help with things too. Um, if you see something, say something. Uh, a lot of people have the cameras. They have the uh, uh, all the brands of the home cameras and stuff. That catches a lot of stuff uh, that goes by. We, we've used them before with cases and with collisions and things. But we ask the public to be aware too. Uh, you can start at home preventing things happen. Thieves and people that want to take your stuff are creatures of opportunity. So try to remember, try to think, okay, set you a time in the evening times where you know you're not going to be back out. Mm-hmm. And say, I'm going to check my garage door. I'm going to check my doors, make sure they're locked, my windows. Uh, make sure my car doors, just take your little key fob, do it that way if you want to. Mm-hmm. Hear the horn beep, you know you like car doors. And that way, don't make it easy for somebody to take your stuff. At Appalachian Wireless, we have the best service and the best deals right now. Save up to $500 on iPhone 13s and 14s, all models, all gigabytes with trade-in. Maybe go for an iPhone 12 for a penny. A penny with a two-year contract. We're not leaving out Samsung. Save up to $350 on select Samsung devices, including the S23. It's a win-win this month at Appalachian Wireless. The service, the savings. Y'all got to jump on this deal right now. At Appalachian Wireless, we get you because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. AppalachianWireless.com for terms In addition to checking locks, citizens are advised to be aware of your surroundings, refrain from posting on social media when traveling, and if you see something, say something. If you see something, like I said, you say something. Uh, If you see, if somebody's in your neighborhood at 2 o'clock in the morning and you don't recognize who it is, and they're walking with dark clothing on, they're walking around, uh, probably no good. Probably no good. Call 911. Call the local police department, sheriff's office, Mm Kentucky State Police. Suspicious activity. Uh, most of the time your gut feeling is going to be right. That person's not supposed to be in this neighborhood. And they're looking to do, they'll park somewhere and they'll walk into the neighborhood and take what they can. So, you know, just go on your suspicion, your hunch. That's not right. You, you see something, you see somebody driving in a vehicle or the roadway or, or laid over on the seat or on the steering wheel, they're probably intoxicated. Or they have, may have a medical emergency. So either way, you're probably going to save a life. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.